I'm just going to, I want to um, keep low in that. That's good. I want to share what I saw. Um, I saw the Lord, and he was in a smelting furnace. It was, a, it was the furnace of God. And he had, this long, he had this long pole, and he dipped in, and what he brought out was the pure molten gold to create the keys that he was giving us, going to give out today. And so let, just let me prophesy it. I just wanted to show, and I said, Lord, it's, it's dark in there. He said, didn't I say I was covered with the dark, the dark clouds? He said, I am smelting the keys. The Lord says today, I am loosing my furnace in the earth. The Lord says, my furnace burns brightly and hotly, and it refines, yes, even you, says the Lord. And the gold that I am bringing forth out of you in this season, says God, will be the keys to the future that I have prepared in this season for the earth realm. For God says, there are gates, 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 there are gates of revival, says the Lord. There are gates of deliverance, says the Lord. There are gates of healing, says the Lord. There are gates of mental clarity, says the Lord. And I am loosing those keys today. So will you? Will you receive my furnace today, says the Lord. Amen. You know, when she was talking about Gates, I don't know why, the Bill Gates came to me. I've never had Bill Gates come to me. Father, in Jesus' name, I bind every spirit that's influencing Bill Gates right now in Jesus' name. Lord, I say shift him or move him out. In Jesus' name, save his soul, Lord. Let him change and mo be modified by you into your likeness in Jesus' name. But don't let him have a negative impact on our country any longer in Jesus' name. What you bind, you bind. What you loose, you loose. You got something? Oh. I got to tell you about the offering. Million is spelled with two L's. You can't do eyes. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're going to take an offering to bless everybody. This is uh, just a wonderful opportunity. I want to, before they, before Alan, Casey come, I looked around the room during worship. I don't know if some of you may have seen me looking. Because it felt different than any other gathering we've had so far. Now, we've had some good gatherings. Reyes back there has videotaped them. I mean, we've had some powerful gatherings. But this is a different season that we're entering into. And if we don't go to that next level, we will not get the victories and the results that the Lord wants us to. And as I looked around the room, I said, Lord, what, what, what is this? And he said, it's the foundation. And then you were talking about the ladder. See, if you don't have that ladder on a good foundation, yeah. I've, I've done that, <laughs> okay? That's why I got metal parts on me. Uh, uh, the foundation that's in this room is low. We've been a long, we've been a quarter of a century, maybe 30 years with some of you. I met Darlene when she was five years old in Head Start. I was a volunteer in Head Start. My mother was the director, and I got in trouble, and my punishment was I had to be a Head Start volunteer guy <laughs> when I was in my teenage years, and I was Darlene's, what did they call us, locked up counselors or something, I don't know what they're, <laughs> I mean, Steve Shell back there, 55 years, I mean, it brings honor to the Lord when you honor each other, and you love and respect each other. And you don't try to make everybody look the same, talk the same, act the same, dress the same. The uniqueness in this group, it's a privilege for me to be a part of it. I, I am blessed. My life has been enriched. And I, just, I, I love you guys. Well, some of you I like, but I mean, <laughs> I, I love most of you. Some of you don't, well, uh, you know, kind of be corny to walk up somebody you don't know. I love you. I mean, I, I'm not like that kind of person. But we've had a quarter of a century of walking together 
So let's give the Lord a hand clap. He said, they'll know you're Christians by our love for one another. And there are many, many people in this room that love one another, and I'm glad to be a part of it. So.